Okay, a little revision to my kit. The Kelty Red Wing is a great pack, very well made, very comfortable, but just not big enough for um, multi overnights depending on how much gear you're taking in the bulk of your gear. My gear does tend to be a little bulky. So, the Big Bear, uh, this is the 82 liter because that's the one that was on sale. They're $67 on the internet with free shipping. It's not a real high quality pack. It's not going to carry, you know, I'm not going to have more than 30, 35 pounds in it max. It's a uh, light, weighs 3 pounds, 14 ounces, and it's got plenty of uh, room in it for, for my gear. Uh, on the bottom is my sleeping bag, got my sleeping pad, got that little REI side pocket out there with my uh, Frost Mora, Steri Pen, trowel, uh, some cooking gear in there. So that's all kind of as one unit there. I can take that off. Still got the mesh pockets on the bottom there for my water bottle. It uh, has one outside pocket here, one big outside pocket, and that's where I'll put the two quart canteen and the paracord is down there. So those two things are down there. Uh, already inside here is my sleeping bag, and here's my clothes bag, and here is a food container. Bear boxer. This is uh, a bear container. If you're going to be in bear country, you need to have one of these. I'm not. I do have one, and I plan on going up north this year where there are bears. And then, uh, you know, stuffed in there is in plenty of room. Is my pot there? So I got plenty of room. The uh, bushcraft USA tarp. I'm just kind of throwing in here. The steaks, hammock. You know, plenty of room. It's got cinch straps. Some webbing, the bush uh, buddy type stove, the wood gasification stove, and then on the top pocket here, it's got a dome pocket, some cinch straps, you know, kind of an inner cinch strap. Again, this is pretty light nylon. This isn't gonna, this isn't gonna make it for a lot of uh, bushwhacking type use. It's kind of a nice, uh, they call it cilantro green, but I think it's brown. And then in the dome pocket here, I got my rain pants and TP and first aid kit, and it's all set. So again, we're weighing about 30 pounds with some water. Uh, my sleeping bag is rather large if I'm not using my summer weight bag, but it takes up a lot of room down there. Uh, the the hall loop, I, I don't trust it at all. I, that was not that that should have been in there with some webbing behind there. So I'm just gonna have to grab it by the straps. The shoulder pads are rather thin. I would agree with that. The hip belt is uh, actually pretty substantial. And the way I carry my pack, most of the weight should be on the hip pad. Anyhow, so the shoulder straps shouldn't really be cutting into you too much. And it's got two aluminum stays. So 3 pounds, 14 ounces. A lot of it inspired by the Colin Fletcher, Chip Rollins book. I've read versions 1, 2, 3. And uh, this is 4. So that's the backpacking style.